Hey guys, what's going on? James here, Crank Fabrication, and today I'm going to be unboxing a new tool that I just received in the mail. So let's see what we've got. So here it is. This is my new Evolution 14 inch metal cutting chop saw. I went with the 355 over the, I think it's the 380, uh, which the 380 can have a, four, a 15 inch blade on it. And it has the um, a cast aluminum base where this has the stamp steel base. But so let's get to unboxing this thing and see what it looks like. There we go. I do like how it has the quick release. Pretty nice. That'll save a, save a lot of time. It does come with this little piece that uh, is for cutting square tubing. It just slides onto the right there. So we got our new steel blade for our evolution saw. So let's get that put on. There we go, got the blade on, easy enough. Close this. see here we are missing a leg so let's hope that's in the box okay guys after going to the owner's manual trying to figure out if we're supposed to have four of these rubber feet just looking at the front of it there i don't know if you can see there but that back corner does not appear to have a rubber foot on it like the front so I'm guessing we're not missing anything. It did just get a little damaged in the shipping process, it looks like. As you can see, I'm, I'm guessing that entire piece is so supposed to be sort of flat there, and that's what it's sitting on. But yeah, you can see there, it's definitely, definitely hit something. And looking at the box too, there's a little bit of damage on that bottom corner there. So yeah, you can see there, a little bit of crankling on the corner of the box. So I'm going to try to straighten that out, make sure everything sits level. We want to get the most accurate cuts that we can out of this saw. Alright guys, so I'm going to end the video there. I was hoping it was going to go a little smoother with this unboxing and we'd be able to put this saw to use. Um, I still may try it. I'm going to get a hold of Evolution first to see exactly how damaged it is. Maybe I could be wrong with how this foot is supposed to be positioned. So we'll get in contact with them. And if it's going to be fine, if it's something I can, I can tweak myself, then we'll go ahead and do some cutting and I will make a video on that. That's it. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Get it, get it, get it, get it.